You're listening to KEXP at 90.3 FM in Seattle, streaming worldwide at kexp.org. I'm Cheryl Waters down here in the studios. It's Ty Siegel and White Fence. Welcome. Thank you. Super, super happy to have you here. And a beautiful new album called Joy. Why don't you take it away? Ty Siegel and White Fence live on KEXP. We see oceans, baby blue. We see oceans, baby blue. We see oceans, baby blue. We see oceans, baby blue.
Ty Siegel and White Fence live on KEXP. That is awesome. That is a sweet, I understand. And you have a new album out on Drag City called Joy. Thank you all so much for coming in today. It is always a pleasure. Thank you. To hear this music live. Uh, can someone introduce who's here today? Because I know you all have a gang of very talented friends, and I'm always excited to see who's going to show up. This is Tim Presley. Charles Moothart. Josh Polkovitz. And uh, You'd be a group of friends <laughs> traveling across the land together. I, yes, yes, you are. And uh, your last album, uh, Ty Siegel and White Fence, came out in 2012. And when I started seeing the press for Joy, I think in like a one paragraph, I saw the word reunite like six times. And you're all so busy with other projects. It makes me, you know, that put a bit, they said it so many times, I had a vision, you know, long lost, they finally reunited. But do you see each other? you know, frequently, and then it's just, this is when you had time to finally make a new record together? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, both of us, especially Ty, just busy doing our things, and then it just was time, I guess, to do it. Yeah. It just, yeah. It was strange because it's something, like, that was never not talked about. It was never, like, oh, we're just going to do the one thing. Yeah. It was like, oh, yeah, we got to do that again. Yeah. That's what I was wondering. It maybe not isn't even a matter of here's where I have a little bit of free time, but like, boy, we've kind of let that go for a while. <laughs> we better, we better get on another yeah. one. I think it kind of was like that. I was like, wait, we really got to do this. Yeah. What are we doing? Time flies. You are certainly cute musical kindred spirits. And how do you feel like your sort of styles complement one another? So you, all, you both have a range of, you know, output that you've had. I don't know. That's a weird one. I've... I, I couldn't tell you exactly, personally. All I know is that there's like a, a really, I think we communicate really well with each other yeah. in this weird way, you know? You only meet a handful of people in your life, like creatively that you have that with. Mm -hmm. Like writing songs, it's, it's, it's very much finishing sentences type yeah. stuff in the studio, you know? How long does your friendship go back? I don't know. Yeah, we were trying to figure that out. Um, 2010? 10? Eight ish? years something? Yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. But we, like, have known, like, the same, a lot of the same people for way before that, you know, yeah. kind of a thing, too. I know. It does really feel like a gang of friends. You've got so many great, talented friends, and they pop up here in the studio, you know, all the time with different bands, and, and we, we love you all. How about in the studio? You've both produced um, records, many records, and uh, what's the dynamic like there? Does someone sort of like become the bossy pants? <laughs> uh, no. You mean with our, our yeah, individual yeah, with records or together? No, together, because you oh, both... No. no, I think it's very, it's very equal. I feel like we can read each other's mind musically. It's like you were saying, finishing each other's sentences. It's like that. Yeah. Oh, very clever. It's a bit we worked out before we came here. <laughs> you do that every night at show, like yeah. it's spontaneous. Yeah, yeah. Um, I love the um, animal compadres that you have on the cover. It oh, seems yeah. like a lot of you, um, I know Michael Cronin has like a, an Instagram and his cat's on there all the time. Yeah, I actually yeah. maybe thought that cat that Tim is holding was Michael's, but who are those friends? Those are, uh, that's Bug and Fanny, and that's my cat and my dog. Uh, yeah, um, they're the best. It's my, you know, it's my family. <laughs> they made it onto the <laughs> artwork for the record. We've got Ty Siegel and White Fence live in the KEXP studios. The new album called Joy is out on Drag City. What do you got next? Uh, my friend. My friend? Yeah. Oh, I love that one. Can I please have a little more guitar? I'm sorry. Never apologize for more guitar. You 
tip to inside your bed But you need the one that alone You're with all of your friends that you make fun of I see you falling down I see you falling down I see My sweet friend My sweet friend My friend from the new album by Ty Siegel and White Fence. It's called Joy out on Drag City Records. And if we can talk you into one more. How much time do we have left? As much as you want. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> want to play a 30-minute song? Let's, let's dig in. All right. What's 
should we do? Do you want to do Easy Rider than uh, Black Glove? Yeah. Yeah. I like the lights in here. Yeah. You're going to love the video. Can't wait to be 
Nicely done. Nicely done. Ty Siegel and White Fence here in the KEXP studios. We have such pretty voices together. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank the you new for album, us. Joy. I love it so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Come back soon. You've got a tune to KEXP Seattle. Discover new music at listener-powered kexp.org.